Hey guys, my name is Elena, I'm a graphic designer and welcome to my channel about a graphic design. And today I'm going to show you how to draw this background with help of blend. And if you're interested, please keep watching. Let's start our tutorial. Let's move those colors to the swatch panel. With the help of selection tool, select all colors here and press this icon and new color group and OK. Here it is our colors. Now you need any color in the field and you need to select start tool. Here it is. Press in any empty place and here we need 90, 45 and 20. OK. Move here. Now select liner gradient, this one. And here we need this color, here black and here gray one. Move the slider like this. OK. Now hold ALT and make the copy. You need to align these two shapes, select them and align them vertical. Now select both shapes, object, blend, blend options and here we, we need these options ok object blend make ok the shape is ready now move it here now in the stroke we need any color I select black select brush tool with these options here we need smooth and let's draw shape like this or you can draw your shape okay now select the shape and this one object blend and replace spine. Okay, the effect is ready. Let's fix it. Now select direct selection tool and select this shape. Now selection tool and make the shape bigger. Okay, like this. Now the same here. Direct selection tool. Select this shape selection tool and make this one smaller. OK, now it's pretty. Let's make it a little bigger like this. Now let's add background. Select this color and create a rectangle 1000 to 1000. OK. And move here send to back now copy and paste background and move copy to front select this shape and the copy of the background right click and make clipping mask now release clipping mask and i want to show you what you can change colors as you like just with help direct selection tool select these two shapes and here you can add in gradient any color as you like and change them as you like. This way you can create uh, many interesting, interesting backgrounds and many interesting shapes to your design. And as well you can select this all and make clipping mask again. 
That's all for today guys, hope you like my tutorial, if yes, give me a like and subscribe and see you in the next tutorials in Adobe Illustrator or in the next videos about a graphic design. Bye bye guys! Mwah.